Hey guys, welcome back to this new tutorial in which I will show you guys how to install All The Mods 3. Now All The Mods 3 is a very fun, uh, full of mods, mod pack, and this one is in 1.12 Minecraft. So it's the newest update with all the newest mods, and it's very fun. Um, if you guys didn't know, I do have a series on my channel, so go check that out. Um, also, there are multiple all the mods. There's one, two, and there's an expert mode and a light mode. So please go support the creator, which is what the drunk. And also, if I can, if I get 100 likes on this video, I will create my own mod pack for you guys. You guys can request what mods you want in it. And let's go straight to the tutorial. Um, so first. I am using the Twitch desktop app in which uh, you find mod packs and it's also used for other games as well. It's mainly like a community app and also there's a lot of confusion but this used to be called the curse launcher or curse just in general. But uh, Twitch and curse merge together and once you download t this Twitch it is basically the same as curse so all my past tutorials do work. Um, I've changed all the links so you download the Twitch instead of Curse. And I hope that clears up a lot of things, but let's quickly go and show you guys. So I will have a link in the description on where you can go to download the Twitch desktop app, but I will also show you guys how to search it in case it doesn't work for you guys for some reason, like in the future. So basically you search Twitch uh, desktop app, you search that, and it's the first one right here. It's called uh, app.twitch.tv. You can press on that, and this is probably what I'm going to link you guys to. As you can see, it says you can launch in browser. I wouldn't do that. I would download it. The download process is simple. You open it up. Uh, you log in with your Curse or your Steam or your Twitch account, which all of them are fine. You can link all of them, I think, together too. So that's kind of dope. Now, I open it up. Uh, it has all these features, all your friends, stuff like that, gaming communities. Now, basically, you create an account. People can add you. And uh, you have a Minecraft tab right here. Now this Minecraft tab appears if you have the actual Minecraft downloaded and installed. Um, and then once you have that, it will pop up here. Um, all, and you need an account as well, of course. But these are all just mod packs I've installed. So this will be empty for you guys. So there's that. You go through, browse all the mod packs, browse FDB mod packs, which is Feed the Beast, or you create your own. Uh, so that is why I want to create my own. Now I do have one called Wondercraft, so you guys please go check that out. I want this to blow up. If it doesn't, it's fine, because remember, if I get 100 likes, I will create my own custom mod pack, and you guys will tell me what to put in it. Anything you guys want. Now, all right, let's go to browse all mod packs. So this is where you go to look for mod packs. Now, as you can see, a lot of the, all the mods are just exploding, because it's crazy fun. But at the time when you're looking for this, if it's not there, it's fine. You go into the search bar on the top left and you search all the mods. And as you can see, all these uh, show up, but what you want is all the mods three. So you press on that. And over here, it would say install. For me, it says play because play I already have an install, but it was so, something like this. So install, install. For this one, it says play because I've already have it installed. Um, their page has a lot of information about servers you can join and different um, pages for you to ask them questions. There's different virgin, versions, not virgin. <laughs> and please go, support, go show support to What the Drunk. Um, his mods are very fun. His mod packs are very fun. And I hope this has been very useful. Now, I understand there's always questions and problems. So if you guys do come across some, please let me know in the comment section below. And also, uh, there's a lot of things you can do in all the mods 3 when you open it up, you create a world. Uh, it gives you an option uh, in creating the world to do different kind of worlds. So I did Biomes of Plenty, but there's Lost Cities, which is like uh, just uh, basically a abandoned city. So it's kind of like Daisy. Now, as you can see, I will kind of play it for you guys a little bit, just so you can see what all the mods 3 is if you're new to this. Um, now I don't want, I hope this doesn't spoil anything, but this is from, uh, my series. So there's that. 
we'll let this load and there you go so as you can see this is a bunch of cool terrains and stuff uh you have these berry bushes and my home uh it's a very good game as you can see the page has 42 different pages of mods and it gets there's more every time they have an update so that's really cool about that you just go through all that and there's so much you can explore uh like i definitely want to try to get one of these backpacks they look really cool uh they're expensive though but it's fine wow uh, that's not bad i'll probably make that in the next episode so wow this is useful for me too uh other than that it's just really fun you know you can make it as simple as you want it and as complex as you want it because there's just so many mods in this. Um, other than that, I don't really want to get this video going too long. Uh, again, comment below if you have any questions. Let me know if this worked for you. You know, show me some support. I love support. Uh, sh maybe some criticism. Uh, you know, anything that could help me in my YouTube channel would be fine. And I think that'll be it for now. If you guys enjoyed, please hit that like button down below. Also hit that like button down below for that new mod pack I could make if you guys get to 100 likes. And you can start commenting right now what mods you'd like to see in it. And what you'd like me to call it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.